So hello guys. Today I thought that we'll do a video on a topic that many people find difficult, and so that is why we have taken up the topic that is how to solve geometry. Now, see, I understand geometry is not a difficult thing, but sare sum sare liye kari kya sare. There is no one way of making a geometry sum. There are plenty of ways of making geometry sum, but you need to know the concepts. So I'm going to teach you two very important concepts today. Let's start with the two sums that I've taken. uh and before that we have a new live batch starting i just want to announce for all of you uh it is starting on the 1st of april and uh, these are all of things there are going to be live lectures i'm going to take the live lectures myself everything is going to be taught by me uh and the best part is that our lectures don't have 300 400 students uh most of the times on an average our our lectures have about 30 to 40 students at one point so that is why each student gets attention and each student does understand everything on top of that doubt solving and everything we have live doubt solving lectures every week to wo hote hi rehte hai every week there is a huge time table that goes on and i'll give you a day to day time table on what to study so that is something that has really benefited my students a lot so this is the announcement and apart from that there is a free live session that i'm keeping today uh, that is on cet schedule and strategy i'm going to tell you no matter what what score you are scoring कितना तुम्हारा प्रिपरेशन हुआ है तुमने कब प्रिपरेशन स्टार्ट किया आई एम गोना मेक यू अ स्केड्यूल एंड आई टेल यू हाउ टू स्ट्रेटेजाइज योर ओवरऑल स्टडी फॉर द नेक्स्ट थ्री मंथ्स सो दैट इज गोइंग टू बी टुडे ट्वेंटी सेवेंथ मार्च देर इज अ रजिस्ट्रेशन लिंक इन द बायो बायो द वीडियो तो वो तुम देख सकते हो एंड द रजिस्ट्रेशन स्टॉप एट टू ओ क्लॉक बिकॉज आई सेंड ऑल ऑफ यू द लिंक्स मैं व्हाट्सएप पे सबको लिंक्स भेजूंगा ओके सो लेट स्टार्ट विद जोमेट्री सो गाइज In the figure given, PQR is TU is a regular hexagon of side twelve centimeters. So, ये है twelve centimeters. Just make the pencil thinner. This is twelve centimeters. Hmm. So all of them obviously are twelve centimeters. Now, what is the area in centimeters square of SQU? SQU. Okay, now guys, understand this. समझो अगर hexagon है मतलब एक center है. Center से if you connect all All of them, what happens? It's a hexagon, right? So these are all 60, 60, 60 degree angles. Wale equilateral triangles. Hai. That's how a hexagon is made. We put six equilateral triangles ko saath mein lata, hexagon hai. Now let's look at an equilateral triangle. In an equilateral triangle, we know that this is 60 degrees. Uh -huh. Wait, I'll just draw a straight line. We know that this is 90 degrees. Ye wala angle. And this is thirty degrees. So this is a thirty, sixty, ninety triangle. So, समझो अगर if this is one, the side opposite to thirty degree becomes root three by two. Root three by two of the hypotenuse, and side opposite to thirty degree becomes one by two. But that is not what we are concerned with. हमें ये चाहिए ये. ये देखो side opposite to sixty degree in an equilateral triangle is root three by two degrees. So let's use that. Hmm? ये देखो नाउ व्हाट इफ दिस इज द सेंटर एंड आई ट्राई टू कनेक्ट द पॉइंट टू इट द वर्टाइज सेंटर थोड़ा बाजू में बट ठीक है व्हाट इफ दिस इज द सेंटर अब देखो दिस इज अ 90 डिग्री बिकॉज दैट्स अ परपेंडिकुलर दैट आई हैव ड्रॉन दिस एंगल इज 60 डिग्रीस सो दिस एंगल बिकम्स 30 डिग्रीस सो You can say that this is root three by two. Similarly, this is root three by two, and this is also root three by two. So the total of this becomes root three. Root three into what? Root three into the hypotenuse. Root three into twelve. That is twelve root three. That is what this entire side U Q will become. Now this is a property for all. All hexagons and all equilateral triangles that are inscribed in a circle also, which means hexagon hota hi hai. See now understand and and see I'll teach you how to use this property otherwise also. ये देखो समझो अगर ये circle है. Circle के अंदर मैंने एक hexagon बनाया. Hmm? And many people will see this in many sums. Right? Circle के अंदर I'll make a hexagon. एंड वो सर्कल के अंदर मैंने एक ट्रायंगल बना दिया इक्विलैटरल ट्रायंगल अब दिस इज अ प्रॉपर्टी ऑफ ऑल 
all equilateral triangles which are inscribed in a circle that ye dekho ye radius hai ye radius hai but because it's a hexagon so the side of the hexagon will be equal to the radius so if there is a circle or uske andar ek equilateral triangle hai so that equilateral triangle usme tum easily nikal sakte ho that uski side will be how much radius into root 3 root 3 r so ye property yaad rakhna this is something that it's not a property but ye mere just maine derive kiya hai this is something that i have thought of by myself so yeah here what do you know if this is 12 this is 12 root 3 now since this is an equilateral triangle iska area kaise dhoondenge to root 3 by 2 into side square that is into 12 root 3 square that is into 144 into 3 so this is into 72 216 root 3 that is option b agar tumhe ye wali property pata thi to ye sum solve karna was a deal of 20 seconds 20 seconds it will come immediately mujhe pata hai that side 12 hai ye aa gaya 12 root 3 12 root 3 square into root 3 by 2 आ गया तुम्हारा आंसर इमीडिएटली दैट इज द काइंड ऑफ कंसेप्चुअल गलत है द सम इन इट सेल्फ इज रॉन्ग आई टेल यू हाउ यहाँ पे मैं क्या दिया है लेंथ एंड ब्रेथ ऑफ रेक्टेंगल आर एट सेंटीमीटर एंड सिक्स सेंटीमीटर रिस्पेक्टिवली द रेक्टेंगल इज कट ऑन फोर वर्टाइस सच दैट यू फॉर्म अ रेगुलर ऑक्टोगोन द रिजल्ट फिगर इज अ रेगुलर ऑक्टोगोन वॉट इज द साइड इन सेंटीमीटर ऑफ द ऑक्टोगोन अब गाइज बहुत ध्यान से समझो बहुत 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 ही ध्यान से समझो इसको आधा काट देते ओके लेट्स टेक सारे ऑक्टोगन है रेगुलर मतलब सारी साइड्स इक्वल होंगी आई विल टेक ऑल द साइड्स एज 2x दिस इज आल्सो 2x दिस इज 2x एंड दिस इज आल्सो 2x हम नाउ अंडरस्टैंड अगेन वेरी केयरफुली अगर ये 2x है मैं इसको बीच में से काटता हूं एग्जैक्टली सो दिस विल बी x दिस विल बी x सो ये टोटल इतना कितना हो जाएगा दिस विल बिकम 4 सो दिस बिकम्स 4 x सिमिलरली ये वाले साइड में ये आ गया थ्री एंड ये आ गया एक्स सो दिस इज थ्री माइनस एक्स नाउ गाइज इफ यू गाइज नो दैट ऑक्टेगॉन हर एक पॉलीगॉन की प्रॉपर्टी होती है दैट ऑल द एक्सटर्नल एंगल्स इक्वल टू थ्री सिक्सटी डिग्री सो अगर इसका एक्सटर्नल एंगल थ्री सिक्सटी डिग्री है तो एक एक एंगल कितना होगा वॉट विल बी दिस एंगल इट हैज टू बी थ्री सिक्सटी डिवाइडेड बाई एट and that gives you 45 agar ye 45 degree ye 45 degree to ye dono equal hone chahiye na but 4 minus x is never going to be equal to 3 minus x that means the question in itself is wrong the question cannot be possible ye figure ban hi nahi sakta tum ek ek rectangle mein se tum regular octagon bana hi nahi sakte never never can you do that you can only make it out of a square okay but fir bhi hame answer to dhoondna hi hai How we do it? Now understand. ये eight minus two x होना चाहिए ना, and ये six minus two x. मतलब eight और six दोनों से इसकी value कम होनी चाहिए, right? It has to be less than six also, and it has to be less than eight also. मतलब by default it has to be less than six. Now look at the uh, look at this. Okay. Three into root eleven. Root eleven कितना होता है? Three point six something. बिकॉज थ्री पॉइंट सिक्स थर्टी सिक्स स्क्वायर कितना होता है वन टू नाइन सिक्स तो थ्री पॉइंट फाइव जितना आ जाएगा थर्टी फाइव 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 ट्वेंटी फाइव एंड ये आ गया ट्वेल्व तो वो भी नहीं तो वी विल से थर्टी थ्री थर्टी थ्री स्क्वायर विल बिकम थ्री इंटू इलेवन थ्री इंटू इलेवन वन ट्वेंटी वन इंटू नाइन वन ट्वेंटी वन इंटू नाइन विल गिवी नाइन ट्वेल्व वन जीरो एट ये वन जीरो एट नाइन तो ये आ गया सो दिस इज थ्री पॉइंट थ्री इंटू थ्री माइनस सेवन 3.3 पहले वही देखो अगर मैं थ्री इंटू फाइव भी करूं चलो थ्री पॉइंट सिक्स इंटू फाइव कर लेते हैं so that will be 
18 minus 8 will give me 10. So this cannot be the answer. 4 root 7 minus 11. 4 root 7, how do we do? 25 square is 625. So 27 square or 26 square should come. So understand 2.6 into 4. That is 11.2. 11.2 11 minus 11 will give me how much? 0 0.2 or something like that. So yeah, then negative mein value aega. Then this value cannot be possible because negative to nahi sakta. 6 root 11 minus 9. Again, 3.3 .3 into 6. 18 minus 9 will give me 9, which is not less than 6. So answer galat. 7 root 3 minus 11. Root 3 is 7 root 3 gives me uh 1.71. So 7 into 1.7 uh that will give me 11, 11 point something. So 11 minus 10 will give me 1. 1 is too less to be your answer. The answer has to be 2.9 and that is option A. Deko galat sum may be answer dhunna ek art hai. <laughs> so that is why we'll mark the answer A. That is how we are going to solve it. And guys, this is the level of conceptual knowledge that you should have. Sab log hai na, option use karte arithmetic mein. Option choose karne aana chahiye CET mein even in the proper CET geometric equations. That is only how you can solve it very, very fast. Agar tumhe ye concept jo mene bataya wo abhi pata hai, then you can very easily solve this sum also in 30-35 seconds. And that is the entire process of how I, how I teach you and crack every test. So yeah, ye angle mein bana tha. So we have the live course and there is also the new recorded courses that we have. You can find all the information on our website that is crackeverytest.com. And guys, if you like the video, then uh, please drop a like and tell me in the comments what is the next video that you want me to make. Which topic should be, what video should be, which preparatory video should be. So I'll post the videos accordingly. So I hope that you guys like the lecture and I really hope that you guys understood the concept. And I'll see you guys at the live session that is today evening at 6 o'clock. Bye guys.